This is skill number eight, occupied bed making. So first do your introduction, wash your hands, knock, knock, knock. Hello, I'm CNA Christine, can I come in? They say yes. Good morning, is it okay if I check your wristband before I get started? Mrs. Jones. Nice to meet you, Mrs. Jones. I'm here to make your bed. Is that okay that I perform that today with, with you? She says yes. Okay, Mrs. Jones, um, before I get started, I actually have to leave the room to gather my supplies. So I'm going to give you your call light. If you need anything, in the meantime, hit your call light and I'll be right back, okay? Here you go. So, wash my hands, leave the room to gather my supplies. So my supplies are going to be a protective barrier for the side table put my items on, bath blanket, three pairs of gloves, pillowcase, blanket, top sheet, draw sheet, and fitted sheet. Okay, so Mrs. Jones, I'm back, just set up my station, I'm going to go ahead and close your curtain for privacy. I'm just going to make sure that the wheels are locked for safety, raise the bed to my working level, lower the side rail on the side that I'm working on. All right, you doing okay, Mrs. Jones? All right, I'm just gonna push these off to the side. All right, realize, um, wash my hands, put on some gloves. Okay, Mrs. Jones, I'm gonna need some assistance from you. I'm gonna go ahead and start off by putting this bath blanket over you so I can remove your top sheets. So if you can help me by holding the top of the blanket so I can keep you warm. There you go, and covered. So always un unravel it, don't shake the sheets. Make sure she's covered. Okay, Ms. Jones, just go ahead and hold the top of the blanket while I pull your sheets down, okay? reach under, pull the sheets down to the foot of the bed, and once you pull the sheets down to the foot of the bed, just go ahead and remove them. Make sure she's always covered with the bath blanket for privacy and for warmth. When you grab the sheets, make sure you hold it away from your body, and you're disposing of these in a soiled linen barrel. I'm just going to set them aside in my soiled linen barrel. Okay, Mrs. Jones, you doing okay so far? All right, so next I'm gonna scoot you over a little bit closer to me, and I'm gonna do it in three sections. So I'm gonna just move your top closer to me. One, on the count of three, move over. One, two, three. Her midsection, okay, on the count of three. Move closer to me. One, two, three. And then her legs. On the count of three, move closer to me. One, two, three. Okay. Also, Mrs. Jones, if you could cross your arms and cross your legs for me. And so, for the state test, it'll be an actual person, so it'll be a lot easier than a mannequin. So, she crosses her arms and crosses her legs. Okay, Mrs. Jones, you're going to roll onto your left side, and when you're on your left side, go ahead and grab that side rail for support, okay? Ready? One, two, three. And then just adjust the pillow. Place it under the resident's head. Hey, Mrs. Jones, you doing okay so far? All right. Let's make sure she's covered. So the next thing you'll do now is to roll the dirty sh bottom sheets inward. Rolling it inward so all the dirty is kept inside. And tuck it in as much as you can under her. And then verbalize clean the mattress. Make sure there's no materials on it. Then you're going to be doing a glove change. So you take off your gloves, verbalize, sanitize my hands, and put on new gloves. So also, don't be afraid to move this closer so you're not walking back and forth. So this skill is going to require three glove changes, one for this side, one for the next side, and the last glove change for the pillowcase. So next, you'll grab the fitted sheet, 
place it on the bed. Or just slowly unravel it. Don't shake the sheets. Make sure you find the corners. Take your fitted sheet and roll it towards you. Make sure there's no wrinkles. The next sheet you'll get is the draw sheet. So you want to arrange it to where it's widthwise. That'll cover from their thigh to their middle of their back. So when you shift them, they're protected. So you'll take one end, go ahead and tuck it into the side of the bed. Next one, just rearrange it and remember to always roll it towards you. And you can tuck this into the fitted sheet. Okay. All right, Mrs. Jones, I'm going to go ahead and roll you on your back, okay? There's going to be a, a bundle of sheets, so don't be alarmed, okay? On the count of three, just go ahead and lay back on your back. One, two, three. All right. Okay, Mrs. Jones. Just fix your fitted sheet. So next, I'll go ahead and raise the side rail on this side because I'll be switching to the other side. the side row and the side that I'm working on. And basically do the same thing that you did on that side to this side. So you're going to have to reposition Mrs. Jones closer to you. So I'm going to move you in three, Mrs. Jones. Ready? One, two, three. Midsection. One, two, three. And then her legs. One, two, three. Okay. Once again, Mrs. Jones, go ahead and cross your arms and your legs for me. She does that. On the count of three, go ahead and roll onto your right side and grab onto the side rail for support. Ready? One, two, three. Make sure you adjust the pillow so she's comfortable, so she's not overexposed. So next, you'll go ahead and grab the dirty sheets. Make sure keeping rolling all the dirty inward. Verbalize, I put this in a soiled linen barrel, but I'm just going to set it aside for here. And then now you'll have your next glove change because you've touched dirty sheets and now you're going to clean. So take off my gloves, verbalize, throw it away, sanitize my hands, put on my new gloves. have rolled under here, you'll go ahead and just pull them to cover the rest of the bed. Don't forget the draw sheet that you have under her as well. Okay, Ms. Jones, go ahead and line your back. Ready? One, two, three. So now, your gloves are still good because they're clean. We'll go ahead and grab the flat sheet, place it on top of her, and always ask her to help you out to promote independence. And you'll go ahead and remove the back blanket. Okay, Ms. Jones, just go ahead and hold the top of these sheets for me, please. I'll then remove your back blanket. Always make sure that the clean sheets never touch the ground. Okay, Mrs. Josh, just go ahead and hold that for me. Just gonna pull your bath blanket off your body now. 
Okay, so go ahead and remove the bath blanket, verbalize, plug this in the soiled linen barrel. Okay, just kind of, at this point, kind of look at the sheets, just make sure that it's even. Make sure you don't cover her face. What I like to do is just put this over the bed, make sure it doesn't touch. Make sure the sides are even. Okay. Next is to put the blanket. So Mrs. Jones, if you can go ahead and assist me again with holding your blanket in place. Always look for the tag. Tag side should be at the bottom, at the foot of their bed. So right here's their tag. Okay, this is Jones. There you go. Just open up the blanket. Kind of even everything out. So now it's time to do the mitered corners. So what you'll do is you'll go to one corner, tuck in, lift the mattress and tuck in the blankets, like so. And then you'll pull this extra part up, kind of creating like a 45 degree angle. Then you'll take what's dangling here, tuck it in, and then you'll get your fold over, like that. So you'll go over to the other side and do the same thing. Lift up the mattress a little bit so you can tuck in the blank blankets. Pull the sheets up to get like this 45 degree angle. Tuck in what's left over under the mattress. Get your fold over like that. Go to the foot of the bed. Make sure you pull a little bit to create that toe pleat gives their feet wiggle room so that's not constricted. Also at this time, go ahead and fold this over. All right, so last but not least, you have to change your pillow. So of course, go ahead and remove her pillow. Mrs. Jones, I'm just gonna remove your pillow. There you go, take a moment. So don't grab it. Let's just pull the pillow out. Soil linen barrel, take off your gloves. At this point, you can put on a pair of gloves, but you want to make sure you sanitize your hands. I'm just going to use my bare hands at this point. So I'm going to pull the pillowcase, the sides, upward so I can expose the middle section of the pillowcase, the crease right in the middle. So with that, I'm going to place my hand in the middle. So what I'll do is I'll look, grab the pillow, look for the tag, grab it from here. Next, I'll go ahead and be able to pull the sides down over the pillow. Next, just go ahead and, Mrs. Jones, I'm just gonna go ahead and put your pillow behind you now. Sat, verbalize, sanitize my hands, verbalize, clean up my area. All that's left now is to do your ending. Okay, Mrs. Jones, I'm done. Is there anything else I could do for you? She said no. Okay, well, here's your call light, or here's your side table. Let me go ahead and give you your call light. If you need anything, here's your call light, and I'll be right back, okay? And here's your bed controls. Just make sure that the wheels are locked. Bed is in its lowest position. One side roll up, one side roll down. Open the curtain. Always go to the foot of the bed, check her alignment. And now that everything's complete, wash your hands and document and leave the room.